All right, so this is the new uh, Can-Am I got. Um, this is my second weekend testing it out. So far, so good. I put the light up here, LED, for at night. I figured uh, uh, after last weekend, it was a little bit dark with uh, the regular headlights. So I added that in. I also added in uh, the winch myself, and I did uh, heated hand grips. And uh, what else did I do? Heated hand grips. And then I also did the mod here for the box. This box here can actually tilt out of the way and have access to the box underneath here. Um, I have a video coming out on that. This is my prototype. I will be making a different one out of aluminum. This is steel. It was a bit too hard and to work with. Uh, I can actually make the exact same thing, just as strong in aluminum, and I'll be showing that in the next video, hopefully. And um, the only thing is I was wondering about is I put the ball on there, but I'm not sure how strong that trailer hitch is attached to the diffs. I don't know. I have to ask some of the guys that actually used it a few times, like guys from Frankie's channel, and they all have can -Ams, I'll ask them. But overall, uh, I'm very happy. It is a pain in the ass to take the plastics out, but they do look cool. And uh, overall, so far, I'm pretty happy. It has a lot of power. I can't complain about that. It has a lot of power for a 570. And um, I just took it out, actually. <laughs> Got a little dirty. Um, and uh, the way it performs, uh, the lock system on the ruts and everything, no problem. I have to say I'm impressed. Uh, where the Mud Pro got stuck for 10 minutes, my brother and I, he's got this exact same bike, we just like crawled right through it. It was pretty good. So, and uh, he's talking about getting a can down too. But he's going to get probably an 850, something like that. Um, 850, 1000, they're great, but I just think that's a lot of power. If uh, that's what you're into, that's great. But I'm happy with the 570 for now. Maybe in the future I'll get 850. I'm not sure. But right now the 570 is good. All right. Uh, overall, I give it a 9 out of 10. Minus the, for the plastics, they're a little bit of a pain in the ass to move in and out. There is some clicking in the, in the front. And my brother has the same thing. So I guess it's when you engage it, it gives it a little click. But... I guess that's normal because uh, his does the exact same thing and we are breaking them in still so and uh, everything seems to be fine up here so yeah I'm happy so far we just I just put a, a bungee cord here so we easy access to the hooks and if you're underwater you don't have to go all the way down there to get it I normally would keep it up here somewhere but I don't want to scratch up the paint um, the seats are very comfortable, I have to say. It is very comfortable. And uh, throttle response is good. Everything's pretty good. Um, and that's it. Like I said, 9 out of 10. As opposed to my Articat, maybe a 6. The Articats, I don't think just, they're not up to par. They're just not up to par. Alright, thank you for watching. And uh, don't forget to subscribe or press like. There's a few more pictures of uh, my uh, mechanism there for the box, and uh, I'm just looking into some strong material, uh, an aluminum uh, type material, and that's my next video, hopefully. And uh, it performed great. We had to get into the tools on one of the trips, and it was really nice. Um, just to add to uh, the performance of the Can-Am, it, it, it was amazing, like we had a great time and stuff like that. The only issue I had besides the clicking was the brakes. Uh, we kind of, uh, I lost the brakes a few times, it felt like there was air in there, which I'm bringing to the dealer uh, on the f in a couple weeks and uh, for the first 10 hour oil change and uh, have them look at it. Because it's new, it might have been just something that they overlooked or I overlooked, whatever. We'll find that out. Yeah, you're on camera now. Yeah.
<laughs> hey, she know where she go. Are you stuck? Are you stuck for real? Are you stuck in the mud? <laughs> It's going, it's going. I'll come over there and give you a hand, but don't put it for that. Right. Yeah. <laughs> okay, you're on. Oh, wait, Johnny. I saw you going to the left side. <laughs> All right, stop. No. Yeah. The lock works at Can Am. Johnny, here, buddy. Good job, guys. I'm not on camera, but I did it too. Thank you for watching, and I am gonna get a new GoPro hopefully soon, so I can show you some of uh, our triumphs with the Can Ams. Thank you for watching, and don't forget to click the like button. Thank you. Here are some pictures, just of the bikes as we get off. <laughs>